Good morning. We are going to be doing a morning stretch exercise today. And I will find some music for you to really lengthen, warm up your muscles and warm up our muscles, get our back stretched out. Just 10 minutes of a workout this morning and it is morning sometimes you might be stiff in the shoulders stiff in the hips low back neck all of these areas we want to get warmed up so go ahead and take a seat and i want you to come forward up from the top of your head and slide your hands down the chair and come up so we'll stretch the back by exhaling down and we come up. Okay, one more time. Just lean forward as far as you feel comfortable. And up we go. Okay, taking one arm, we're gonna to touch the opposite shoulder and hold that elbow. And I just want you to hold it and gently pull it in and just hug that elbow. Sway back and forth and let your head sway. Morning stretch is just really a way to kind of de-stress your day. Touch your opposite shoulder and then give that elbow a hug. And then you can go ahead and sway. It's moving slowly in a um, world that's very fast. It's sometimes hard to do to respond with a calm manner where you feel centered, right? Open those feet up. And if you're on your couch, you can come forward a little bit to straddle. We're going to take the elbow down to one leg and just lean over. Yeah, sometimes when we respond and we're all a flutter, we're just a little bit off center. You know, oh, I wish I could have handled that situation a little better. So come over. The physical practice of stretching and getting in your body and being present is just a great, great way to do that. So we'll go over to this leg again. We're going to reach down. So I've got a little back support with my elbow. I'm going to reach down inside my calf and up. Reach down. slow motion movement, getting the ribs to open up, a little rotation with back support, four, great job, come up, loosen up those shoulders, and let's go down to the other side, so I'm staying nice and long, and then I'm going to reach inside my cup, and turn up, so I'm taking this arm like a big feather, it's floating down, floating up. Great, and come back in the center, both elbows there, and bring your fingers together, and I want you to pull your shoulders down away from your ears, so you're sticking the top of your head out towards the computer, um, away from your tail, flat back. All right, and roll it back up. Let's do that one more time. From tailbone, we extend and lengthen the spine out. Press the shoulders down and lengthen that head out. So it looks like it's from the side. We're pulling those shoulders down and sticking the top of the head out, right? And coming back. All right, let's warm up our hips and get those hips nice and open. Come all the way forward. I want you to feel secure on the chair. So we're gonna take one leg out to the side, slightly out, and we have this leg as our uh, sturdy point. So we slide with an exhale. Hold here. Why do I come to the front of my chair? Well, I've got a little gravity that tilts my body forward. Right? So it allows
allows me to lean into gravity, kind of assists. So you're gonna bring this foot forward now and see if I can go straight down. So just brushing and back up. Wow, I really feel that in the leg. So let's see if you guys can see. I'm holding my toes up to the ceiling because I want to get a stretch through the calves as well. Last one, sliding, checking to see if I can still tie my shoes with a straight leg. So let's take this out at an angle. Hold on to your security blanket here and slide down. Now this may be as far as you get on that leg, and that's okay. Let's do an exhale with it. We're opening up the hip and the inner thighs. We're just testing to the waters, okay? When I go off to this side, I feel a stretch in this side, opposite side of my lower back. Let's bring that foot straight forward. Again, we want to hold our thigh and allow the body to tilt, right? Keep your seat right there on the edge of the couch or the chair. Very secure. And we're gonna do one more. Nice stretch, just working that back side of our body into this. Come back and let's give our back a little bit of support now. I want you to take your elbows close together and we're gonna lift the elbows out and drop the hands down. So if your wrists don't like this extension, right, you can open up your hands to fingertips to level out those elbows, okay? So let's close the chest and open. Of course, guys with broader chests will be able to get those elbows all the way together. It's just an idea. Close and open. If you can keep the hands flat, great. Close, open, and lower. Close, open, and lower. Okay, let's add something to this. We're going to go up. Inhale, up. Bring it down to the chest and open elbows. Inhale, up. Stretch like it's kind of coming out of the top of your head. Okay, so I stretch up above, poke a hole in the ceiling, try to straighten my elbows, and bring it down. Two more. And we're going to stay up there, okay? Even if you're here, that's cool, right? Wherever you can get. So my arms are like pulling my glasses off. And I'm going to lean up and over to the side. And then I'm going to go up and over to the other side. Leaning on the back of the chair, okay? Up and over, trying to bring those arms, opening my head through the arms, right? Getting some shoulder flexibility and also some strength. show you a way to do a little 
prayer twist, which is nice ringing out the organs, allowing rotation in the spine with some support. So you can bring your feet closer together for this one if you couldn't reach, that was like a little test. But if you could, you could stay open. Take that elbow, reach across, and then bring those hands together like we did, and pull them up. I want you to turn, so you're like a swimmer, turning to the side with the opposite over the beach. Breathe here, inhale. Prayer twist, inhale. That's it. One more, soften into the pose. I want you to go up and center. How did we do, okay? So we're gonna see if we can bring the opposite elbow here, and we'll get into it stage by stage. Then we come, bring the hands together, and we turn. If I can't reach across, I'm gonna bring my legs in. Pull up. And maybe this is where you are in your prayer twist, right? Could be down there. And breathe, three. Soften, inhale. Soften into the pose, and one more. So that's a pretty intense yoga twist, right? For, for a 10 minute workout. Let's finish with a sun salutation then. I want to thank you very much for, for joining me. So, come back in your chair and inhale up. You're going to swan dive forward, hold the chair. Take a bow, hold the front of your shins, and stretch up and look up. Forward fold, and inhale. And bring it on in. chair. Pull the front of your shins from your tail to your head. Stick your tail out and bring your face up and then come down. We'll drop the head. Reverse swan dive. Up and in. Last one. Monkey pose holding and come down. Reverse. 